here to do, uh, I think it's confessional number five. Um, I haven't prepared anything for this one. No notes, nothing. I'm just going to go off the cuff since the rounds are going so fast. And I want to keep up and I just want to say, I mean, so much stuff has happened. So I thought I'd do a quick little confessional to get up to date. Um, I don't even know where I left off, actually. Because so much has happened. Um, I think the last thing was that we voted for Blah. Good Lord, so much has happened. Anyhow, so I was at work yesterday. This was uh, Friday. Friday, I was at work and um, I thought that I was still in my alliance with uh, Mr. Spider Jew and OBC and Hyper. And, uh, well, I wasn't totally sure about Hyper because he was having some second thoughts about things. Um, but anyhow, I thought I was with my alliance. We were going to do what we had planned, and that was that. I mean, of course, I was always prepared in my mind for the fact that you never know. They could turn on me at any time. So, anyhow, I thought I was, I thought I was good. I was with them. And I got a message. I was, I told everyone I could be reached on Twitter and DM form while I'm at work and I could always respond on my breaks. So I did get it, uh, some DMs and telling me, you know, I should be careful and stuff like that because I'm a target, which I get at this point, everyone's a target, right? Um, but I, I didn't know that, uh, things were changing and that, uh, you know, that I was in that much trouble. So, uh, I figured even if people are going to vote for me, at least my alliance is still sticking to what we were doing. So if we did, I'd still have the numbers with my alliance to be safe. But little did I know (laughs) when I went home, I mean, when I got home, I, I jumped on Skype and I was talking to a couple people and oh man, if I hadn't have done that, I would have been out and yet I'm still here. So what happened was, uh, Truthfully, I can't even remember who or what I talk, who I talked to first and what about. It was just craziness. Everyone was talking to everybody and it was just nuts. Um, so basically, I talked to um, the people outside of my alliance, or I should just say the person Pratt's, because he was pretty much on his own. He knew he's strong and he's a huge target. And uh, without immunity, he would definitely be out. So, actually, he was the one, I believe, that told me. He even showed me some messages uh, of Spider Jews um, saying, talking about, you know, voting me out and having to take me down. And, you know, I'm, and he was going to, actually, he told me he already sent in his vote to vote me out. This is Claw we're talking about. Um, he he uh, said he was going to vote me out. So obviously, I don't even know where I began and how I changed his mind, but I did. And oh, there's conversations about it, uh, which which you'll be able to see later. Um, but uh, I can't remember what I said. Oh, it's because uh, Hyper, Hyper Dude, you see, this is why I need notes because this is, it probably sounds horrible right now. Hyper dude was questioning me about what happened with LBM and uh, because what happened with LBM wasn't quite honorable or it wasn't on the up and up, which is kind of driving me a little crazy because there are certain moves that need to be made in this game, obviously, for it to be successful. And you can't always be on the up and up with everything and everyone at all times. But anyhow, I told them the whole story. I have never hidden anything from the beginning. Uh, everything has been pretty upfront. I've never told any like huge flat out lies. I've never really mis like really misdirected anybody, you know, into like horribly different directions until now, of course. But I mean, up until recently, I've been pretty straightforward about everything. Um, so I didn't, I, even what happened with LBM, I talked to him and I told him straight out what happened. So 
I guess he chose not to accept it, which obviously that's his choice. I'd be kind of bitter about it myself if it happened to me, but I don't know. I guess because I'm so accepting, I, I'm not bitter about it. <laughs> I mean, if it was me. So anyhow, I explained the whole situation to, excuse me, Hyper and Claw. And because I did that, they decided to trust me for at least that round. In this one, it seems. Um, and uh, so then they, so that's when Claude told me about how Spider and OBC were going against me, and Hyper already knew this. So we actually managed to um, uh, form a, an alliance of sorts. I don't know if it's a solid alliance or not because they wouldn't say that they are with me like a hundred percent they just would say that they would vote like we could all vote together that's all they would say um so anyhow claw was gonna do this because claw he knows he's alone and if at any time he he doesn't get immunity and doesn't use his idol right i mean <laughs> poor claw he's got so much on his side he doesn't need any help but it's uh, it's good that he's modest at least, and he is worried. So he decided to take me up on my little offer to stick together and take out the ones who went against me, <laughs> and um, and and to take them out. So that is what's ha uh, happening so far. So which well, of course we stuck together and we voted for. Actually, we voted for Shoutfix, but um, that was just because uh, I wanted Spider and OBC to think that we were still going according to the same plan. I didn't want them to know that I knew that they had turned on me. But then the next round, which is the current round that we're in, which is, uh, oh, we just ended round 12. I believe, because we are around 13 now. So round 12 had just ended tonight. And um, that's when we voted OBC out. And it was, uh, it, it was, it was crazy. Of course, I don't want to vote OBC out. But naturally, OBC and Spider turned their backs on me to vote me out. And you know what? I'm not bitter about it. I get it. And honestly, kudos to them for finding a way around me. But at the same time, I'm going to obviously do what I can to save myself. So, you know, voting OBC out and eventually Spider Jew, it's not, you know, it's not a bitter thing. It's not a mean thing. I, I mean, obviously it can't be. Like, they did it to me, so I'm doing it to them. It's just I'm being successful at it. Oh, that sounds bad. <laughs> but that is why I'm doing it. I wasn't going to do it. Like, I was... It's so hard to, to explain to get through to certain people, too. Like, I honestly think we should have stuck together because the three of us going to the top three and then the three, three, two of the three of us in the final two would have been ideal. And yet, it just sucks that they had to turn on me. I don't know why they had to turn on me, but anyhow, we're making it work now. I mean, I'm doing the best I can. I don't have an end strategy, unfortunately, not yet. I'm just trying to figure one out. Um, see, this is why I need notes. I'm totally off track now. I'm just blabbing on and on. <sighs> trying to think what the next point was. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Um, so Claw and I have been talking tonight. Um, so obviously our next target is going to be Spider Jew. Um, if he gets immunity, uh, I have no idea who, who will vote for. I don't even know who I would want to vote for, not want, but who I would vote for. And because it seems like I'm the one kind of controlling the vote so I'd probably have to suggest who to go for and I don't even know who I would say like after Spider Jew is out and the other thing 
the last thing, I think this is where I, I'll, I'll end with uh, this last point, <laughs> is um, the the person coming back from Redemption Island. I have no idea who it's going to be or when. I think that's what's that's also throwing me too. But I get it. It's the game. There's all these things. I mean, there's another idol out there. I, know, I already know who has one idol. And, uh, I mean, I don't think that idol is really going to matter, to be quite honest, for the person who has it. Um, but I don't know who has the other idol. And I don't know where the third idol, idol is. Actually, see, now I'm confused. <laughs> This is why I need to plan it out. Uh, I know there's two idols, as far as I know. See, we've been having so many conversations, and people are telling me so many different things. So there's two idols out there. So one I know somebody has it, and the other one I don't know where it is or if somebody has found it. So that's another thing. So all I can do is hope that Spider Jew doesn't win immunity and doesn't have an idol to play. Because if he does have an idol, I am sure he's not going to tell anybody. Because obviously everybody's talking and spilling the beans. And that's why that's why he, him turning on me, and now me and Claw and Hyper taking him out has turned on him. Because everyone's talking. And they don't quite get, you know. I mean, I'm grateful. But they, some people are not quite getting that you're not supposed to make deals with people and then turn on them <laughs> but it's working out for me right now I don't know if it'll work out for me later so anyhow I apologize for the random blabbing hopefully you got some good uh, good points from this one uh, so much has happened I'm sure I missed a whole lot of it um, I'll try to do another one hopefully tomorrow and in, in the next two days talking about all the other stuff that has happened all right See you soon.